Welcome to today's Ibarra Kamili. Let it flow. Turn off the notification, stay connected. Ibarra Kamili, the complete ritual. Marabahu, consecrating the altar. Pumzi, centering your breath. And Guru, channeling your energy. Mwendo, flowing through motion. And Kutapakari, listening and meditation. I'm going to start right now, just with some deep breaths. We haven't come into Pumzi yet, but just feeling the moment, feeling the space, being present. Grounding your thoughts. Mm. Kind of get into a bit of relaxation here. And together, next breath, inhale the arms out and up, reach up toward the sky. Move the fingers, really extend. Bend the back, lift the chest, exhale, bring the hands down to heart center, prayer position. Marabahu, consecrating your altar. In this moment, we invite in spirit to join with us in union for our practice. Considering our space sacred. The space that's around us, the space on which we sit, the life force that flows through us and around us, connecting to divine ancestor, the eternal spirit. In your faith path, whatever speaks to you, whomever speaks to you, inviting in your higher power for communion connection. In this moment, recognizing the sacredness of your body, the vessel in which we dwell, our bodies themselves can serve as the altar. Space, sacred being. Acknowledging that every part of your being, every part of yourself, every part of your soul is divine. Nothing here is less than. Nothing about us is less than. We are manifestations of the Creator, extensions of the Divine. Humzi, centering the breath, bring the right hand to the chest, left hand to the core. Three deep breaths together. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Inhale. Exhale two. Inhale. Exhale three. Continue to breathe, feel free to exhale through the mouth or through your nose, whichever you decide. And exhale through the mouth to release heat. Exhale through the nose to retain heat, whichever you prefer, whichever serves you in this moment. As we breathe, allowing our breath to relax the body, calm your emotions. Clear your thoughts, open your spirit. In many traditions around the world, the breath is 
recognized as a vital life force. Inhale, so exhale. Taking in the breath of life. It is the breath that gives us our center. We have the ability to bring in peace and serenity at any time. Simply by focusing on the breath. Find your natural rhythm. And as you breathe, come into rule of four. Breathing technique of kinetic yoga. Number four, deep inhale, pause, slow exhale, pause. If you can, try to inhale and exhale to the count of four. If that's too long or too short, find your natural count. As long as you follow the pattern, deep inhale. Pause. So exhale. Pause. Moving to Ndubu, channeling our energy. As always, coming to your personal visualization of your energy. You can tie it to an element, earth, fire, wind, water, electricity. You can tie it to a color. When you think of your being, the entirety of your soul, what color do you see? And as you continue to breathe with rule of four, Expand your energy throughout your body from root to crown, toe tip to fingertip. Feel free to release the hands, bring them to your legs if you wish. Palms up and imagine the ball of your energy in the center of your palm. Both hands. What shape does it take? What does it feel like? You inhale, so exhale. Flow. You can even consider connecting your energy to a deity of ancient chemists. Ra, or Amun Ra, the sun god. Thoth, god of wisdom and writing. Mayat, the goddess of truth, balance, and harmony. for movement. Take an inhale, bring the arms out and up, slowly coming up. Remembering that energy that's in your palms, bring it together. Exhale, bring the hands down to heart center. Just 
cross leg position, stretch pose, variation one. Once again, you can release your hands, ladder to rest on your leg, coming into rotations of the neck, shoulders, and waist. Drop the chin forward, bringing the head around to the right side. Actually, we want to bring the chin back down and bring the head around to the left side. Going back and forth, left to right, slowly. And when you're ready, you can feel free to go into the full rotation, bringing the head back, opening the throat. Inhales, slow exhales, rotating clockwise and counterclockwise, or simply left to right. Stretching the muscles of the neck. The upper back. Movement guided by the breath. And slowly bring the head back to center. Shoulder rotation. You can keep the arms down or bring the fingertips to your shoulders. Inhale, shoulders forward, up toward the ears. Slow, controlled movement in sync with the breath. Exhale, back and down. Deep inhale, slow exhale. Clockwise and counterclockwise. So we accentuate the movement. Deep stretch of the chest muscles, shoulders, and once again, the upper back. Up and down, back and forth. Channel your energy through the motion and moving. And after your shoulder rotations, slowly release the hands if you have them to your shoulders. They can rest on the knees or you can bring them to your waist, coming into our waist rotations. Start by leaning forward. Keep your bottom balanced on the mat. And slowly come around to the right side. And just like with our neck rotations, we're going to come from right to left first before coming all the way in a full rotation. Take your time. Keep your bottom balanced on the mat. No need to pull up on one side or the other. As you move, stick with your visualization of your energy flowing throughout your body with every movement, with every breath. Inhales, slow exhales. Really allow yourself to feel the stretch. Connect to the sensation. center, back straight, chest lifted, preparing for seated spinal twist, take your right hand, bring it to your left knee, left hand comes behind you for support, 
Inhale, back straight, chest up. Exhale, twist to your left side. Left hand is behind you, flat on the floor, keep the knees straight. Looking to the side. On the next breath, inhale, look in your chest. Staying in your twist, exhale, look forward. Next, inhale, bring the head back to center on the left. Exhale, look behind you over the back shoulder. Next, inhale, come all the way back to center. Exhale, release. Preparing for the opposite side. Left hand to right knee. Right hand comes behind you for support. Inhale, lift the chest, stretch the back. Exhale, twist to the right side. Breathe into the twist, rule of four. Preparing once again. Inhale, lift the chest. Exhale, look forward. Next, inhale. Bring the head back to center on the right. Exhale, look behind you, over the shoulder. Next, inhale. Come all the way back to center. And release. Coming into our knee folds, still in sesh pose, variation one, that is our seated cross leg. Bring both hands around the right knee. Inhale, lift the chest, stretch the back, shoulders from the ears. Exhale, fold as best you can over the right knee. Chest to thigh, forehead to knee, as best you can. Keeping the bottom balance on the mat. Three rounds of breath here together. Inhale. Exhale, three. Inhale. Exhale, two. Inhale. Exhale, one. Listen carefully, still in your fold. Extend the arms, palms facing down. Next breath, inhale, come up at the core. Arms extended, coming around to the opposite knee. Exhale, hands come down around the left knee. Next breath, inhale, lift the chest, stretch the back. Exhale, fold. Chest to thigh. Forehead to knee as best you can. Breathe here. Connect here. Three rounds of breath. Inhale. Exhale, one. Inhale, exhale two, inhale, exhale three. Once again, extend the arms, palms facing down. Inhale, come up at the floor, coming back center. And this time, still inhaling, bringing the arms up, reach up. On your exhale, fold forward. Reaching as far as you can, press the fingertips into the floor. Extend the back, drop the head, relax the neck. Shoulders away from the ears. Three rounds of breath here together. Inhale. Exhale. Two. Inhale. Exhale. Three. Inhale. Exhale. Four. Inhale. Exhale. Five. Inhale. Exhale. Six. Inhale. Exhale. Seven. Inhale. Exhale. Eight. 
Inhale three. Inhale. Exhale two. Inhale. Exhale one. Next breath, as best you can, come up at the core, arms extended, reaching up, reaching up toward the sky, lifting the chest, stretch the back, exhale, hands come down to heart center. Feeling the moment, centering the breath, channeling the energy, communing with the divine. Next breath, you can release the hands, slowly transition, coming onto all fours. Tabletop, four square. Knees aligned with the hips, wrist aligned with the shoulders. Feet are flat. Crown is forward, face is toward the mat. Coming into Bastet breath. Cat cow. On the inhale, lift up the head, lift the tailbone, push the abdomen down toward the mat. On the exhale, drop the head, drop the tailbone, arch the back upward. Continue moving with the breath. Inhale, slow controlled. Exhale, the inverse. coming into Pyramid Child's Pose. Bottom comes down toward the heels. Pyramid palms, triangle, the third eye to the mat. Elbows pointing out wide. Continue to breathe, continue to stay connected to your energy. Feel it flow throughout your body in these different positions. Next breath with the palms still on the mat. Pushing your chest upward, lifting up the chest. Coming back into four square, tabletop. Going to prepare for side split and half split, opening up the thighs, the quads, the hamstrings, starting with the left leg. Bring the left leg out to the side. Foot is firmly on the floor. Your back foot, your toes can either bend or be flat. Gently push your bottom toward your heel. So you feel the stretch in the inner quad. You can stay up on the palms or come down onto the forearms, whichever you prefer. Holding three rounds of breath. Inhale. Exhale three. Inhale. Exhale two. 
Inhale. Exhale, one. Next breath, come back up into, onto the palms. Transition the left leg forward. Pressing the heel into the mat, toes pointed upward. Gently lower yourself until you feel a stretch in the back of the leg, the calf muscles, and the hamstring. Feel free to use your hands to adjust your leg if you need to. Three rounds of breath. Inhale. Exhale, three. Inhale. Exhale, two. Inhale. Exhale, one. Listen carefully. You want to slowly transition forward, bring the front foot down, coming into a low lunge. Extend that right leg behind you to feel the stretch in the right thigh. Left knee should be aligned over the ankle. Right leg extended behind you to feel the stretch in the right thigh. Your left hand can be on the outside or bring it to the inside, supporting yourself with your palms. Three rounds of breath. Inhale. Exhale, three. Inhale. Exhale, two. Inhale. Exhale, one. Slowly release, coming off of the lunge. Bring the left leg back to you. Pyramid child's pose. Pyramid palm to third eye to the mat. Bottom rest on the heels. Round of breath, rule of four, then slowly transition back into four square, preparing for the opposite side. Right leg comes out, sole of the foot to the floor. And before you push back for the stretch, deep inhale, slow exhale, recentering the breath. Channeling your energy throughout, keeping with your visualization. Next breath, gently push back. Feel the stretch on the inner thigh. Once again, the option to come down to the forearms if you wish. Three rounds of breath. Inhale. Exhale, three. Inhale. Exhale, two. Inhale. Exhale, one. Slowly. Come out of the stretch. Adjust the right leg. Bring it forward. Press the heel into the mat. Toes are up. Lower yourself to you feel the stretch in the back of the left leg. Holding for three rounds of breath. Inhale. Exhale, one. Inhale. Exhale, two. Inhale. Exhale, three. Slowly release, shift the body forward for low lunge. Right knee aligned with the ankle. Left thigh stretched behind you. Left foot is flat. Supporting yourself on your palms. Three rounds of breath. Right hand can be inside or out, however you choose. Inhale. Exhale, three. Inhale. Exhale, two. Inhale. Exhale, one.
slowly come out of your lunge. Bring the right leg back. Pyramid child pose. Pyramid palms. Third eye to the mat. with every inhale and exhale. Next breath. Lifting the chest, away from the palms. Extend forward, coming back into four stairs square. Preparing for our first round of medic lunges. So we're going to start with the right knee forward. Coming into a kneel. Right knee is forward. Make sure you feel grounded and stable. Hug your arms around your thigh. Next breath. Inhale. Bring the arms out. Rise up. Bring the arms up into a wide position. And inhale. Exhale. Bring the hands together. The palms should be facing each other now. Adjust your palms so that they're facing forward. Right palm in front of left. Inhale. Slight back bend. Exhale. Back to center. Controlled movement. Bring the arms down to the knee. From here, we transition from our kneel into the low lunge. Slide the right foot forward, then shift forward, bringing the ankle and the knee into alignment. Inhale, push the chest away from the thigh. Exhale, drop the head back, open the chest and the throat. Inhale, come back up to center. Exhale, bring the hands down for support. Release the leg. You can bring it out to the side. Bring it back behind you. Back into four square. Take a moment. Shake it up. And preparing for the left side. Left leg comes into a kneel. Once again, make sure you feel stable and grounded. Hug your arms around the left thigh. Head to knee as best you can. Inhale, come up, rise up. Bring the arms up like you're bringing up the world. Wide position. Exhale. Palms come together. <clears throat> Adjust the palms facing forward, right palm in front of left. Inhale, back bend. Exhale, come up. Arms come down, control the motion engaged muscles. Slide the foot forward, come into your low lunge. Inhale, push the chest away from the thigh, arm straight. Exhale, drop the head back, open the chest and throat. Inhale, come back up to center. Exhale, come down. Release the leg, bring it back, feel free. Come into some free flow movement once again, whatever you wish to do. Pyramid child's pose. Pyramid palms, the third eye to the mat.
to carry for round two. Inhale. Coming up. Exhale. Four square. Right leg in a lunge. Stable and grounded. Tuck the chest to thigh, head to knee. Preparing yourself here, centering the breath, connect to your energy, imagine the divine moving through you. Inhale, coming out and up. The energy flows from your fingertips. Exhale, palms come together above you. Adjust the palms right in front of left. Inhale, back bend. Exhale. Arms come forward to me. Transition. Low lunge. Inhale. Push the chest away from the thigh. Shoulders, excuse me, arms are straight. Exhale. Back then, drop the head, open the chest. Inhale, coming up to center, using your core. Exhale, coming back down, controlled movement. Right leg comes out. Free flow motion. Whatever you need. Preparing for the left side. On your tabletop. Kneel. Left side. Stable and grounded, hug the uh, chest to thigh, head to knee. Really visualize your divine power here. Inhale, come up, rise up. Arms come up, wide position. Exhale, palms come together. Slow, fluid motion. Right palm in front of left. Inhale, back bend. Exhale, hands to knee. Shift into your low lunge. Inhale, lift the chest away from the thigh. Exhale, open up the chest. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, controlled movement, come down. Release the left leg. Moment of freedom. Pyramid child's pose. Pyramid palms to the third eye to mat. Next breath, inhale, lift the chest. Exhale, four square. Our last round, committed lunges. Right knee, kneel. Down the head, cut chest to thigh. Next breath, inhale, come up, rise up. Keep power flowing from your fingertips as you rise. Exhale, palms together. Right palm in front of left, facing forward, inhale, back bend. 
exhale, come up and forward. Controlled movements. Let the line flow through you. Extend the foot, low lunge. Inhale, push the chest away. Exhale, drop behind you. Open the chest, open the throat. Inhale, come back up the center. Exhale, slow movement back down. Release the right leg. Moment of freedom. Preparing for the left side. Left leg. Final kneel. Breathing your energy throughout, expanding on the inhale and exhale. Hug the arms around the thigh. Next breath, inhale, come out and rise, coming into your power. Exhale, palms together. Adjust, right palm in front of left. Inhale, back bend. Exhale, come forward, palm to knee. Transition, low lunge, bring the right foot forward. Knee aligns with the ankle, stretching the right leg, the right thigh. Inhale, push the chest away. And exhale, drop the head back behind you, open the throat, open the chest. Inhale, come back up to center. Exhale, lower yourself down and support. Moment of freedom. Pyramid child's pose. Pyramid palms to third eye to mat. Next breath, inhale, pick yourself up, lift the chest, exhale, transition into seated cross leg, sesh pose, variation one. Inhale, so exhale. Revisiting our cross leg spinal twist. Right hand to left knee. Left hand comes behind. Inhale, back straight, chest up. Exhale, twist to the left side. Looking to the left. Next breath, inhale back to center. Exhale, look over the back shoulder. Next inhale, come all the way back to center. Opposite side. Left hand to right knee. Right hand behind you. Inhale, back straight, chest up. Exhale, twist to the right side. Breathe into the twist. On your next inhale, stretching up with the chest. Exhale, look forward. 
inhale once more back to center on the right exhale look behind next inhale coming back to center exhale release Sesh pose forward fold inhale the arms out and up reach up exhale fold forward stretching pressing your fingertips into the floor one more round of breath here together inhale Exhale. Next breath, using your core, come up to center. Arms reaching upward, lift the chest, stretch the spine. Do a slight back bend if you have it. Exhale, palms together to heart center. Preparing for Kutafakari, listening in meditation. Choose your resting position. You may choose to stay in sesh pose. Variation one, hands resting on the thighs. You can come into resting recline. Coming onto your back with the legs extended or the knees up. Whatever position you choose to come back to stillness. Recentering the breath with the cleansing breath. You inhale through the nose. Exhale, side out through the mouth. Kutafakari, we take this moment to reflect upon the practice. To allow ourselves to receive any messages from spirit, from the divine, from the ancestors, simply from within. Nothing else, use it as a place of peace and stillness, communing with the divine in this moment.
bring your mind back to the moment. <clears throat> Moving it back to your body. Wiggle your toes, your fingers, your torso. And then slowly taking your time, come into a comfortable seated position. Back straight, chest lifted, eyes closed. Take a final breath together, inhale the arms out and up, reach up. Reaching toward the sky. Exhale, palms down to heart center. Yoga means union, union with self, union with others, and union with spirit. We give grace and gratitude for our communion with spirit in this practice together. Allowing us to feel the divine flow through us in connection with our energy and the fullness of our holistic soul self. Let us remember that yoga is not something you do, it is a way of life that goes beyond the movement on the mat. I bow to you, we bow together. Thank you, Asante Asha. Take the next few moments to journal about your experience. Write down any revelations, any notes. For those watching the recording, thank you for joining me. For those live, be ready for a few minutes of discussion. <clears throat> 